If there's one story this morning that's going to make you stop and, and listen, maybe the most memorable story we have for you of the morning. Some students from Wrights High School got a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to sing on stage with Foreigner. Eyewitness News' Grace Habo was there just a few hours ago when the band and choir performed the iconic hit, I Want to Know What Love Is. Take a listen. Foreigner rocked the house in Evansville. <laughs> and they did it with a little help from the Wrights High School Choir. The world-famous band invited the choir on stage to perform one of their most iconic hits. We were the first ones to register. We won the competition, and it was great. We had a couple after-school practices. Um, we never actually practiced with Foreigner, which was kind of scary to think, oh, you know, we're not going to practice with them, but it was actually a very good way we practiced, and we did great. It was a lot of fun. Bass player Jeff Pilson says he hopes this inspires the young musicians to continue performing. Their energy is contagious because they're excited, and you kind of live it through their eyes a bit. And um, I think even the audience picks up on that. I mean, I think they, they sort of sense the, the realness about it and the... Uh, excitement that the kids have and it it actually does make us even more excited so it's it's just a win-win for everybody and it's a real positive experience i used to be stage fright like crazy and now i feel like i can take over the world and i'm just feel so eccentric pilson says a portion of the merchandise sales will be donated back to the right squire i mean i want my kids and grandkids and great grandkids to be able to sing and perform and do whatever they want without having to worry about funding or private schools or anything like that i want them to be able to do what they feel is released for them in Evansville, Grace Heba, Eyewitness News. All right, a standing ovation. That is so cool for those students and, and their parents and grandparents to get to experience that for one night in Evansville.